Do your videos have a lot of background noise? As someone who watches a lot of YouTube videos, I can tell you that background noise is really annoying. I hate hearing the sounds of computer fans in the background or barking dogs, and it's a really good way to make sure people click away from your videos. But the good news is you can actually change your uh, background noise, you can actually change a lot of the audio in your video. And the best news is you can actually do it for free. Now today I'm going to show you the software you need and the things you need to do to change the audio. So the first thing you need is a video to edit, and the good news is I have an example right here. Let's go into Movie Maker and see what it sounds like. You hear the fan in the background? We're going to fix that. Now the example I have here is a little bit over exaggerated. I took it right next to a fan on high, um, but it'll be a nice example to see the big differences that you can do when you're editing the sound. You'll need to download two programs. The first is the video to MP3 converter. This is just a way to grab the audio from your video to allow you to edit it. The second thing you need to download is Audacity, which is what we're going to use to edit our audio. As I said before, both of these are free, and I'll leave them both in the description so you can download them pretty easily. Now once you've downloaded them both, go ahead and open your video to mp3 converter. Go ahead and click add files and find the uh, video that you wanted to edit. There we go. If you want to be extra fancy, you can create a folder which is where it's going to save. I've already done that before. Go ahead and hit convert. Now it'll go ahead and convert for you. Once you've done that, hit close here, close it all out. A message will pop out. It's just what they do to keep the program free. Um, it only lasts for three seconds. Go ahead and close it out. Now once you've done that, go ahead and open up Audacity. Now what you need is to find your uh, audio, which is going to be the na same name as the uh, video or the same name as the title of the video. Now let's go ahead and remind ourselves what the audio sounded like. You hear the fan in the background? We're going to fix that. So obviously the biggest problem is the sound of the fan in the background. What you need to do is select a portion of that sound, hit effect, go down to noise removal, and click get noise profile. This is the noise you want to remove. Now once you've done that, go ahead and select the entire portion of audio, hit effect again, go back to noise removal, and hit OK. Now let's see how it sounds. You hear the fan in the background? We're going to fix that. You notice it sounds a little bit better, right? The uh, voice is a little bit transformed. Now, it might be a little bit too quiet for you. I'm going to show you one more thing that's really useful. Hit Effect, Amplify, and let's move it up a little bit more. This is going to make your sound a lot louder. Let's see how it sounds. You hear the fan in the background? We're going to fix that. One more thing, let's say there's a portion of audio you just want to get rid of. Let's say your dog barks at the last second, or in my case, I was fumbling around with the camera for a few seconds. So for the audio you want to get rid of, go ahead and select that portion, and then go to Edit, Remove Audio, and then Silence Audio. It'll make it silent during this portion. Now, once I've done all that, I've got my finished product. Let's see how it sounds. You hear the fan in the background? We're going to fix that. All right. Once you've done all your editing, go up here, hit File, Export, and give it a name you'll remember. I'm going to call it Audio Tutorial. Alright, now that you've done that, there'll be some metadata. You really don't need to worry about that. Go ahead and hit OK. Now that you've edited your audio, all you need to do is replace your video's original audio with the audio you just made. Now in most video editors, the easiest way to do this is to silence the original audio and add a new audio track. Now in Movie Maker, I've already silenced the audio, so now I'm going to find my edited audio and put it in the editor. Now one more thing you should be careful about is make sure your video syncs with your audio. But now let's see how it sounds. You hear the fan in the background? We're going to fix that. And there you have it. You can't even tell that there's a fan running right next to me. And we've really improved the quality of our video. It's only taken us 10 to 15 minutes and it's completely free. So there's the tutorial, you guys. If you have any further questions, be sure to leave them in the comments for me. And if this has helped you, be sure to leave a like. Alright, thanks for watching.